I don't know, somewhere along there, we got interrupted. It got broken up. My word, the devil is busy. So, I don't know, you'll have to patch these two together now. So let me just back back just a little bit. Let me back back just a little bit. I'm saying to you that a hallelujah is the highest form of praise. Hallelujah is a celebration of God. So study to show yourself approved unto God. Search for the Holy Spirit. Sing the songs of Zion. Get together and sing them. Who cares what note? Who cares what key? Sing them. Sing them together. Sing them to yourself. Sing them with your children. And in the process, you're able to encourage yourself. So when you pick up the pages of God's word, when you read it, when you open it, when you share it in your own hearing, when you sing the songs of Zion, and then you get on the line and testify, celebrate God in your house and celebrate it with one another. And you, beloved, will be encouraged of the Lord. Let's pray. Father, I thank you for those who are aboard, and I pray that the Holy Spirit will knit back together the broken communication that we had. Put us back together so that our thoughts are complete. Don't let the devil steal our joy. We want to be victorious, and we want to be a living witness of what faithfulness to God can do. So on this Wednesday, we may not be able to be at the church, but we can be together on this platform and we pray that you would bless us as we prepare other platforms. Now, remember those who live alone. I talked to Fanny Payne today. She was a little bit depressed. And so we've agreed that more of us will call her. There are others who are at home. They aren't saying anything. But we are asking, Lord, that we will all be mindful of them and make ourselves a committee of one to reach out and touch one another. A one-minute phone call several times a day is better than a 10-minute phone call once a day. Help us to be busy, to set aside the time to study and pray ourselves. As we move forward, may our rest tonight be whole as we do it competently in you. And when we awaken tomorrow, may we not forget that we have been blessed of God. Help us to be a blessing to somebody else. Thank you in the name of Jesus and for his sake. Amen. Amen. And amen.